Welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Cancer, for love and relationship, for the month of October 2024. This is for love and career also. Let's start with love right now. You have a current relationship that is really working very well. You have a full understanding with your partner at this current time. I get here you and this person think about really past memories between you two and it's really beautiful. But you want to stop this person from listening to others because you are afraid that this person is going to be influenced by others not to give you money, to help you, to start like you know really maybe lending you money or you want to take a loan from them at least you want really like you know just to benefit materially from that person too it's not like you don't love them of course you do and i get here that there is really certain that this relationship is going to get ahead in life you want your person to be really moving away from their past their, their exes um some of you are uh, already established like you know, a commitment with someone that they are really willing to isolate someone from their past or it could be like you know, a partner that in love a relationship with them that they are not really happy with them anymore and they want really to divorce that person um, they have the promise to divorce that person and be with you but they are really still not ready completely for divorce because they want to succeed materially before they reach that level with you. And I get here a delay or a setback after another. But <coughs> a lot of you are with someone that you are newly wed or married or about to get married in case to that person that they don't have any re other relationship, only you. And they are really worried about their material also situation at this current time. I get here material situation can be really like you know very uh, scary for that person and to you you want really like you know just to, to benefit or to hold on that uh, material thing like you know but uh, because before anything bad happen so you will secure your life you want them to secure your life like you know to write you something to write you a condominium apartment building um, a home uh, maybe a boat <laughs> something like you know to do with uh, you want to share with that person financially and i get here that you are holding on material really positions with them like you, know, you want them to be really right something for you and i get here that you are worried that other people involved around sister brother family his or hers like, you know, that they will interfere with your business and they are not going to make you really happy. It could be children, 
of his or hers also, that they are going to take away what you deserve. And you want that person to really check on that also. Okay. This person, like, you know, that maybe you had a problem in the past and they came back to you. And if you haven't really, like, you know, if you have a problem with someone, they will come back on track with you. And I get here, this person is really opening up. They are trying to get rid of, like, you know, really um, something to do with the uh, problems with taxes or it could be, like, you know, really um, lawsuits or something like that, too. You have some negative on you, like, you know, that you cannot stand, like, you know, some people around the person that you want. And you want them to be really, like, you know, strict or push those people away. You don't want them to deal with them anymore. You feel like, you know, that there are too many lessons, like, you know, for them to learn that they are not learning. And you want to tell them what to do and it comes, like, you know, overwhelming. Sometimes you feel like you, know, that you are being pushed away or your person is really gonna st stopping you from thinking bad about certain persons. And you feel like you, know, that those pe you don't want to continue with the, your person until those people stay away from you completely. You are being demanding there. What you expect is hurting you really a lot. This person doesn't really want to hurt you or harm you. They don't have a bad intention for you. And it says here, like, you know, that they give. They are a giver. They love you so much. But they feel like you sometimes that you think differently than what they said. They said something, you take it maybe in a wrong way, and you don't understand, and you, and you keep holding on this that give you anxiety and worry. And you need to relax. You need to be really, like, you know, just directing this energy into something really beneficial. And uh, I get here that you have a lot of negative on your energy because you expect something too much maybe from that person to do at once. Take it step at a time. It's really better that way because if you force an issue or something to happen and another issue, another issue, at the end you're going to be really sick, worry only and harm yourself mentally and physically. And there is no peace of mind until you get to that degree where you want to be at. Just go with the flow. It's really better. Your partner is afraid because they have so many demands on their life, like, you know, right now. Money, sabotage of business, sabotage of time, money, situation. And they have responsibility also of their own, maybe children from another person that they were married to or be in a relationship with a long time ago and they want to give like everybody like uh, having demands on their money at this current time you feel like you know, that nobody deserves like you know, his attention or anything and you want really everything for yourself this person is really giving you what you want they are not cheap and they are not really against you at all so they tell you here there is no need for you to push the situation because at the end you're going to be harmed with that person that you love even though that they don't push any harm for you but it's going to reflect badly on you that's what i mean this person is coming through they will be really like you know coming to give you what you want what you ask for in time they are waiting like you know for money situation to come to them maybe their money is tied up like you know with something you want this person and i get here but yet you are really gossiping within you between yourself that if they don't really like to give me what i want i'm gonna leave or you want them to give you now because you're afraid that they're gonna leave or in or they are going to be influenced by someone from their relatives to leave you so you want to benefit now you want to take advantage of the situation the 
this person not going to pay the bills, taking care of their children, taking care of you, taking their, care of their business, home front. They are always going to succeed. So they are not going to be really falling down or apart at all. This person is holding on you. You need to be strong at this current time. You need to support them like you know, emotionally because they are irritable at this current time with too much demand on the business. They are not really feeling very well because of being worried sick about money situation. Even like you, know, you find that they have money, but there is trouble. There is some trouble here and there. They could be like you know, having like a you know, lawsuit or something or something to do with taxes too that they want to finish or repay. Other than that, I'm getting that you get your wish. He or she is going to be a husband and wife to you. You need to stop worrying. You're your worst enemy. You think too much. You're afraid and worried about too many things that the you are not supposed to be worried about. It's kind of like all of it attached to you or in your head. Like they're going to hurt me. They're going to harm me. They're going to push me away. No. And some of you, like, you know, who is really having an addiction, you have to lower on it. If it's tobacco, or it could be, like, you know, really drinking, or it could be drugs, it could be, like, you know, even, like, you know, medication. You want to hold on this person for a purpose or a reason, and I get here, you get all of that that you need, but you don't have to rush into it because the other person starts to misunderstand you. Other than that, I see your life is getting ahead. There is a turn to the barrel with finances for your person. And I get here, they will give you and lend you the money that they supposed to give you a long time ago. They're going to give it to you. You're going to have it. You're going to have the project that you want also. A new business for you. A new business for your person too. So it looks to me it's really pretty good. Let's talk about money. Money and career for this month, for next month. This is the October month. For cancer. Okay. Let me see about money situation for the cancer sign for the month of October. Money. Money and career or business. Anything to do with money for cancer for October 2024. You might really having a business or establish a new business or a small business at this current time or you want to sell your product or you want to do something. And it seems to be that, you know, your profit at this current time is really small. And I get here in a very short time that this money situation is going to increase and you will have a financial success. Emotional problems are really interfering with your money situation and your direction at this current time. You will take a break from work, like, you know, really to have fun sometimes because your mood, you know, is really like, you know, not really very good. And I get here that, like I said earlier, like, you know, that you're, if you are in a business, you will have a bigger commission or if you have a work situation, bigger commission, money is going to increase for you. You're going to succeed, really. But you have to resolve the issue and the inter, like, you know, the conflict. You might really like, you know, interested in uh, someone else at this current time. And it says here you have problems with a current relationship. It could be a spouse. And uh, you need to have faith. If you are really having your own business, and I get here, this is coming through for you. And you will make really good impression on people. At work, if you have a regular job, 
or you have a business and I get here your heart sometimes won't be really like you know into work really very much but you will have financial security you're gonna have inheritance or you can be really supported from another person that is in a relationship with you to give you really extra money in the future near future you're gonna have bigger business than the one you have or thought about and you are going to be really increasing your money more sometimes like you know that you have you are working for people and you want to really like you know just really let them go because you are not really happy with their demands on you and i get here this uh, this uh, uh, a problem like you know at work it can be really erased or released if you work on your emotions eternally externally to dissolve or resolve that issue with that person it's like you have a temporary blockage on you and that progress or unemployment like the things will improve you will be having more work than you can handle if you just let go all of your bad emotions towards someone you will be in a position of power success more demand but you have to be really like you know just getting along with the person that you love because this is personal relationship is affecting the money situation if you are really like you know just understanding the person that you you have or you are with you can really increase your money but some of you are sitting there like you no know, you don't want to work you don't want to do anything but you want money in the bank you want like you no know, cds you want like you no know, stocks you want really gold you want really to hold on that you want really like you know just a business with you not doing anything like a building for example and you want this work or business to work by itself well if you have a business you need to work very hard for the business because no business is going to succeed without you working in it but god give everybody upon what you wish but you don't have to be really like you know hater demanding like you know for like hater for others around your person for you to get what you want and it's kind of like I'm, I'm trying to tell you exactly here that the way you are approaching that money is not really right. Be loving to others, even even if you want to fake it. Be nice to others, and especially in front of like you know, the spouse, if he or she having family, and support them on others, and you will get what you want when you are really like you know, pleasant, and this is really best for all of you. So. I don't see you in a bad situation financially you will always get the help that you seek and your work is going to improve because you are waiting to leave your job to have a business but you don't want to work on the business that's not going to work have a good intention money will come to you really easy i see a lot of you like having a business already and it's not working but it's going to work for you best of luck for you dear cancer i hope you enjoy the reading and if you need a private reading, please contact me and the link for my website is below this video, mysticalaziza.com. After you click on reading prices, please purchase your reading, then give me a call and my phone number is listed on my website. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.